Hello, friend, and welcome back once again to Garrick's Peace War in the East. Let's um, take a look at the air war first and what I might need to, to do. First of all, we have Jagdke Schwader 54 up here. Uh, let's quite a few fighters why would they have those guys in there that okay well it means I'm gonna have to, to, to change it up like this the The thing is that um, these are recon units. Keeping it with Story is a bit, is a tad dangerous. I'll move them to Saltsy. Next, uh, I really wish that it would have been possible for me to get these individual planes out. Problem is, I can't. So, um, Is currently 109 G2s. All right, got it. There we go. Um, yeah, let's do that immediate transfer. <clears throat> Figured it out. Excellent. Okay. <laughs> I knew it was possible. This is a lot better. So now, indeed, at Saltsy, yeah, I have a few more planes there, and it's, you know, they don't have enough men. But I, I really don't want to have those planes in Star Yerusa. Like, if the Soviets run one attack and that goes wrong, basically, uh, I'd be screwed. So, uh, definitely not doing that. What I find interesting is when the AI decides to be at 75 or 100 or something like that. Anyway, um, there are also transport units here. Mm, the question is, do I need them? Uh, let's actually take a look at the depot. The deep house. That are currently here. Um, as well. So the, the transports are also resting. 
And then there's Kampf Group 53. Also in here. Now, <clears throat> we can question ourselves why would I need certain level bombers? And the reality of it is, I think I probably kind of just don't need them. They're currently resting, but they are taking up supplies. Um, so in all honesty, um, I should probably set the entire Kampf Group of 53 to the reserve. Uh, they seem to have quite a few recon units still as well. There's also Flieger für Ostsee, which has air recon units. Mm. That's Königsberg. Is that really it? Uh, the transport group is what. Uh, yeah, those transport planes are, are what's the thing here. I might send those transport planes to Stalingrad. We'll see. Let's deal with uh, Air Fleet 6, which is over here. It seems to also have the Hungarians, interestingly. Um, Sixth Air Fleet is quite stretched like that. Let's just take a look. First of all, we'll have these recon units. They're in Demyansk, Dugino, and Vyazma. I guess that's fine. Then we have the 11th recon. Also fine. And again, we have a, a bunch of, of bombers. All 88 A's. So it's not even dive bombers. Are the... Um, I mean, we have the SDGs there. Yeah, exactly. Um, about Jagdschweder 51, there are 40 planes at Vitebsk, some 40 at Vyazma. I don't don't really like the placement of those at Vitebsk, to be honest. I'd rather have them move up. Unfortunately, there's no other air base in the near vicinity, and there's none at Zukunishki either. If we take a look, there's also no additional airfield there, except at Yuknov, but we don't control it. Um, any other airfield that could house 40 planes is Bryansk. Mm. which is an option or to send them to Rojev which I think is even more of an option it's probably better to transfer them from Vitebsk 
uh, over it to Rajev. No, I... Why would they claim it's so many? There we go. Mm. Yeah, I do want to transfer these to Rajev. I know that from Rajev currently they cannot fly, but that Shouldn't really be a thing. And then, supposedly, like the orchestrator forty one also has some units at Yesa for whatever reason. Why would those units be there? Let's send the rest of those planes over to Orel. Since that doesn't make any sense. And uh, now they're at Orel, Viasma, and Rajev. I think that makes a lot more sense for them to be there. Now, I actually think that at the very least, I want to remove KG4, send them to the reserve. Funny that all those different parts actually have different insignias. At any rate, it does alleviate Smolensk. They are no longer overburdened. Now, I could potentially use those Junkers 88s as air support over at Rajev. So I'm going to leave those guys for now. Which puts me to the Hungarians. Um, why this is yellow is beyond me. It's kind of weird. Okay. All of the units are at Stereoskel. All of it, yeah. Bomber group, fighter group, recon squadron, and another fighter group. The bomber regiment. I'll send those guys
Why would they... That was weird. Okay. I do have to find a regiment ready, indeed. I want to keep those, just like the Long Range Recon group. They're actually a pretty reasonable place. Sometimes I'm just really confused as to what's going on. So we have a few units from Yaga Schrader 3 here at Potomnik. Definitely there. And then they have a part of it at Smolensk. Absolutely mad. But um, given the situation, I'll probably want to get all of them somewhere else. But uh, let's talk Italians. Again, as for this Italian bomber group, I'll send those to the reserve. Seems like all of them are to Mark Kafka, both the recon and the fighter. Hmm. Whereas there is no actual depot there, which is. Well, th this is going to get overrun very quickly, I think. Well, let's let's just re redeploy them for n uh, no. Hmm. Um, I'm just gonna move those Italian planes into Fort Shieldgrad. Because Fort Shieldgrad is most likely, like, I don't see myself holding this necessarily. And I don't want to remove these guys twice, so I'm definitely just moving those units there. Like, why are those fighter squadrons at Constanta? I, I don't. This is some. Those are fighter bombers trained as fighters. That's good. Their mission is also fighter. I also have to take a look at the fighters which are trained as bombers because then they need to get trained as fighters first. Then we have to put them back into the reserve. This is just two hind two recon planes. Like what the heck? That's they have no planes here. No, they do. There, there are some units on the airfield. They're Gashrader 52, okay. Uh, but they're... So messed up. This is fine because I'll likely retreat from that area anyway. These are bombers, all of them. No, it's all recon. Of clanks, okay. Mm, well, first of all, I don't need those, those two recons at Elista, because I'm, I'm gonna get out of there. Um, let's put you the rest stuff. There's still planes there. 
Not for planning scope of 12 and 31. Really makes you wonder, like, where? Where are those? Bomber, recon, bomber, recon, recon, fighter group. Um, in terms of first Hungarian fighter regiment. That's our Hungarian BF 109s, eh? Huh. Let's see if I can put these and uh, first Hungarian fighter regiment. There's no airfield here. Putting them there is very tricky. No airfield at Castorno either. Um. Let's get that first Hungarian fighter regiment to Stariasko. So they do have the second part of the first Hungarian fighter group there now as well. The bombers can stay here. But let's transfer those recon units. The long range Hungarian recon group that's out here, or was there. Mm. Guess. Both of them do go to Olshanka then, or, well, that's fine though. Um, Hungarian transport group, huh? Mixed mission. Hmm. Well, we'll see how that goes, but that, that does look uh, a lot better now. Mm hmm. Fighters are at Stariasko. Got 70. They have all of these tactical recon units. 
but I have to say I don't think necessarily I will need them. I have ninth and first there. And then there are plenty of other recon units over there to, to deal with stuff, so. I don't necessarily feel like getting them all to the reserve, but I'm gonna send them over to Stalino. And then in Stalino, I'm gonna use rest for them. Okay. And there's still of Klang's group of three and twelve. And I have to wonder. It's an AGR two. So that's all of there. Plenty of recon. That since Kai Airfield is overburdened already. Um, Let's move him to Salsk for the moment. There we go. And then at Salsk, I also want them to rest for now. I don't need them for the immediate future. That's fine. Um. Okay. We're not even close to being done. That's a large territory. Eighth Fleet Guard. What about Fourth Fleet Guard? They also have a huge territory. But they're mostly down there, it seems like, with some units. Let's see. These guys have. Arm of your makeup, Krasnodar. And age here, 4, 9, 16, Yaga Schrader 52, STG 77. Okay. The immediate problem for them is that they have units in Karpovka. Those need to get out. So. Um, wow, really? The entirety of STG2 is in there. This is a bad situation. Comp Group of 55 is definitely going to go out and will be sent to the reserve in its entirety. That should relieve. Some pressure from Morozovska. Hmm. 
Hmm. Currently, fifty fighters in there. Question is where are they gonna go? I kind of need all these fighters and all these bombers. But the problem is I don't want them here. Rather I would wanna have them here. Now there are no Romanian fighters here, just Romanian bombers. I don't think those Romanian bombers are going to have that big of an effect. Those are going to go to the reserve to free up space for STG 2 to go to Kotelnikovo here. Or to have the Romanian fighter flotilla down here as well. As for the Romanian or Kotelnikovo, it's at 56. If I send these over here, it's going to be overburdened already for STG2. Seems like the fighter flotilla would be able to handle it. But another thing I could do is send the Romanian air transport group from there. over to Novocherkask. And then these are just part of fourth air fleet, okay. The fourth army recon group is part of Romanian air command south as well, so that's this. They've only the Romanian Army Air Recon Group. They're part of 8th Fleet Group. They should be part of... There are no fighters here, just... Recon, Recon, Bomber. Okay. I'd like the recon at the very least and the fighters, but how many recon planes? And what recon planes can I get from? Uh, from here. These are still 12 fighters that I could use. If they, they move further along. Uh, 
I at least want to have them here. And they're on their fleet four, so that, that makes uh, makes sense. No. Let's get them out and get them to Kotelnikovo. That means that there are slightly, you know, less planes in this area. There's still SDG-2 with a lot of bombers. And SDG-1 down here. <laughs> Problem as far as that. What? Uh, oh, they have a lot, okay. This is six recon units. I'm gonna keep all of them at arm of here. Because it's a bit ridiculous to have those few planes up there. Okay. There are indeed more of this stuff. Tactical recon at Pitomnik. There is only one plane down here. Okay. They're going to go to raw stuff. Basically, I need to prepare for the potentiality that I'm going to need to retreat back to the donuts. There is a chance like that. I don't like it, but I need to get my planes out. I need to destroy certain depots and stuff like that. Wonder how I can abandon the airbase. Or what happens with these units if it gets taken over? But I will have to look that up in the manual. Anyway, uh, let's continue. They're in a weird place. It's because they're in a weird position. One of them has zero focal rules, the Tatsinskaya. And in that Maycop, they have that. Let's um, send all of these to Maycop. They're under Luvafacadio Don, which is yet another air group.
We have these two recon units at Tatsunskaya here too. I, I don't need them there. Let's send them to Fort Shilovgrad. Yes. Most of these are at Kotelnikovo, but I need the ones at Karpovka to move to. Yes, I can. Good. So the entire STG-77 is now at Kotelnikovo. Still have STG-2 STG there. There's 34 Romanian recon units. Should probably go to Milarovo, but Milarovo is also overburdened. Currently by KG-27. Um, but to be honest, at the moment I don't have any reason to have these guys anywhere here. That's... No. Cancel that transfer. Okay, I guess not. I'm going to send all of these to the reserve. And that seems to alleviate Milarovo quite a bit, which allows all units from the Romanian recon groups to head to Milarovo. Good. A lot of recon. They're all on the eighth Flieger Corps. Um, honestly, I'm gonna send these to Kharkov. Yes, and like this is 22. That should be enough. I'm gonna send these 10 over there too. Immediate transfer. Yep. Jagerschwader 3 has a lot of planes at Potomnik, a lot of fighters, and then some of them at Spolensk. Um, Potomnik is here. The thing is, though. If I want to hold on to Stalingrad, that I'm gonna need fighters in this area. I, I cannot allow the Soviets to go and bomb it. All 
Oh, this seems crazy. Sounds guys full. Could tell me Kova's full. Twenty second Panzer Division is really that poor state. I guess they are. Dude, oh, you gotta be kidding me. Two thousand men. Oh my god, no. How? How would you ever do that? Okay, um, STG2 is gonna go to for shelf grad, like, you need to transfer me out. The only ones that I want in there are fighters, and it does seem, at least now that that would be the case, most likely. Next up, these. The problem with these guys is that they're all trained as bombers. And I want to withdraw them for... Uh, okay, these are tactical bombers. Uh, but the other ones were fighter, pilot, they're Fighters trained as bombers, that's no good. Heinzel 129B. Seven planes. KG 51 is there. Reserve, reserve. Now I want to send the rest of these guys over to Makivka. again transport group suit not it's gonna be too much but I cannot have any of these at Morosovskaya. I 
I, I just don't get why the, the number is so big. It's it's very weird. Anyway. Yoga Schrader 52. They have 40 fighters. And Olshanka. Like, I can kind of get that. But since I'm gonna abandon Kokladni, um, Sending those to Krasnodar. Uh, no. How much of them are at Mekop? 38. Probably don't need more. I'll, I'll be sending these to. To Korlovka. So it takes them out of there. It's just some recon. Train this fighter, mission fighter. Fighter, 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 fighter. fighter. Good. The uh, okay, those guys are part of Fourth Flieger. What if I just put them under the ninth? No planes here. Although, for whatever reason, they have that there. Not really sure why. But the more Im Im most important thing here is that. Uh, okay, that stuff is all okay. No more airplanes there. Just making sure that there are no strange, strange things going on here now. Nope. One last peek. Air Fleet One has Yaga Schrader Fifty Four and a bunch of recon units. Um, that's fine. Then I have. KG three 
funnily enough, these guys have recon all over this area. That's fine. The thing that I need, though... Orchestrator 51, is it Rajev, Yasma, Orel? That's good. There was only Yagashrader 52. I got them from there. They're still in Maikop, Gorlovka, and Olshanska. Um, that's also okay. For the moment. Alright. Um... I'm going to end this video here. I haven't done anything except change the air units, but I want to thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed this. I'll um, continue to make a few more changes to the air forces, namely to set them to automated changes and things like that. Um, maybe move them around a little bit. And then I'll also make the air directors. So we can uh, finally prepare for that first air turn. Of course, this kind of stuff takes a bit longer on that uh, that first turn here, but uh, I, uh, you want to do things a bit better. This is going to be the way to do it. So anyway, I want to thank you all for watching. Hope you enjoyed this. See you all next time. Bye-bye.